Well, good morning, Dr. Aldred. It's great to be talking to you here. I saw on your Twitter feed that you're in Jerusalem, you're doing book signings, and you recently bit the bullet and joined Instagram. That's all exciting. Yes, we did all of that. Mm -hmm. I was lucky enough to go to Jet Propulsion Lab's open house this weekend, and there was a huge emphasis on, on Mars, and a lot of people were going there. I think they broke records for attendance. So it seems like we're going to be in a new age, well, another age of uh, high interest in space exploration. Well, I think it's about time we had a Mars generation. Mm -hmm. So it seems like this is going to be uh, a great time. NASA just outlined their plan uh, to get a manned mission to Mars in the mid-2030s. What do you think of that? I would add maybe another five years on that, just to be on the safe side. And uh, I have my own plan that I think NASA is beginning to appreciate. Mm -hmm. It's called Cycling Pathways to Occupy Mars. Uh, how is it different? Well, it has cycling spacecraft mm -hmm. that go between Earth and Mars. And so uh, the landers intercept the cycler as it swings by the Earth, and then the cycler takes it to Mars in about six months. Mm -hmm. And then the landers get off and either go to the moon of Mars or they go directly to land. Mm -hmm. And when they land, everything there on the surface is all ready to take care of them because we've prepared that mm -hmm. ahead of time. Right now, uh, we're actually doing something, you're doing something really exciting, uh, which is you're selling a t-shirt for Share the ShareSpace Foundation. Um, and that would help uh, help kids with uh, STEAM education. Can you tell me a little bit more about that? Well, I sure can. Yeah! That's the thing. That's what I want. And uh, we actually only have a few more days to buy this shirt. So everyone, you need to go get to that now. Represent.com forward slash buzz. And you only have a few days left to get that shirt. So everyone, you're going to need to uh, get your hands on that and 100% of the proceeds go to ShareSpace, and that's helping to promote uh, STEAM education. Uh, what can we do as, uh, as parents, as students of the world, to help make sure that innovation and exploration education continues? I think one thing for sure you could do is to get more familiar with what Mars is like. Mm -hmm. And guess what? what? There just happens to be a book available that just came out mm -hmm. and it's called welcome to mars and it's written by me and marianne dyson an excellent writer just wonderful she knows so much she's been a mission controller and she's written many many books for children what's just one message that people should know about uh getting a manned mission to Mars and getting people to Mars? There's lots and lots of preparation mm -hmm. that has to go into a mission to Mars. And there are many things that we can prepare using the International Space Station and maybe later on other international commercial space stations and then we can learn many things at the moon mm -hmm. by gathering together the other nations and working together where we can uh, design a base and then construct a base from higher up in orbit. Mm -hmm. And constructing a base that's on the surface is exactly what we need to know how to do at Mars. All right, well, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Again, if you want to get the Get Your Ass to Mars shirt, you can go to represent.com slash buzz. Thank you. thank you so much again for talking to us this morning. Well, I'm glad to communicate with all the nerds out there. Yay, thank you.